Welcome back. Well, what can I say? I'd just like to say thank you to everybody that watched my first Frosty video. Everyone that watched, liked, subscribed and commented, uh, thank you. Um, it's truly thank you. I, I, you do these and you don't think anyone's ever going to watch. Um, you think you're just going to, you stood, sat, sat here, sat here. Look, well, I'm looking at a little dot so that I look into the camera. Um, and you don't expect the amount of people that actually do watch you. And I am really grateful for everybody that has um, watched, um, liked, commented. Um, have I said that before? I don't know. Yeah, um, but no, thank you so much. Um, it's meant a lot, a lot to me. Thank you. Well, what a weekend we've had. Um, it's been a wet weekend. And when I say it's been wet, it's been wet. Um, we, we've had a beautiful summer. And um, about weather broke about a week and a half ago, unfortunately. But this weekend, my God... Um, it, it just bucketed it down, absolutely so wet. Saturday, me and my husband, Sean, we went to go see, um, check on his deer. They, they've got some deer on, on the farm and, um, it was dry just as we was just, we was just starting to go out and it's just starting to rain within... 10 well not probably even 10 minutes five minutes the heavens just opened it's like turning the tap on and so much rain the wind was howling you could see the the water just sheeting across the fields it there's not you know i, I haven't seen that like like that for a long time um you know poor sean um they brought in the harvest and now drilling time they've got quite a lot of drilling done and it's just starting to um to grow um you know it's probably about this high now and the rain just battered it just stood on the fields it, it was awful um if i can um i'll put a picture up here hopefully if it works, if it doesn't, just take the notes off me. Um, just to show you um, how much rain. Um, sat Saturday night, um, I don't sleep very much. Um, rather an insomnia. Always have not slept. Um, but my back, the pain from my back stops me sleeping a lot now. So after Sean had gone to sleep, I got back up um, and just... You could just hear it raining all night. I, I went back to bed about five o'clock um, in the morning and it was still raining. And it wasn't just a little rain, it was pelting it down. Um, poor Sean. Um, yeah, he's been a bit fraught over the weekend, worrying, worrying about his crops. Um, so, yeah. Sorry, Sean. Not a lot I can do. I wish there was. Um, at least today is dry. There is that. Although it's clouding over now. Um, but we had a nice day yesterday. Um, we went out. Um, it was Sean's mother's birthday in September. And of course with harvest. Um, he get, didn't get to see his mum. Um, so we took her, her and my father-in-law out for for lunch, um, which was really nice. Um, they enjoyed it, I hope. They seemed to. Um, everybody had plenty to eat. Um, so, and it was something to do in the rain. We, we didn't have a look around. I think it was a nice restaurant in a, a garden centre. Uh, that we've been to, we, well, we found it last week, um, not far from us. So um, we sort of dodged the 
rain having a look outside uh, but that was really nice um, get back home and we lit the fire um, I can't believe how quickly it's gone from being so hot that you don't know what to do with yourself um, to being autumn and fires although it's nice to snuggle down curtains closed fire going very nice um but so yeah that was our weekend um saturday afternoon i just stitched um while sean i think he watched a film um spoke to my brother my brother lives in america um lives in dallas so um we talk through messenger on our iphones it doesn't cost anybody you know, it doesn't cost us anything to speak. And it's really clear, so it's as if he's just down the road from me. So that was nice, because I don't get to talk to him very often. So, yeah, that's about all I've done all weekend, I'm afraid. So, there we go. Um, if I keep looking over, my cat is the other side of the iPad. She's just over there um, and she keeps looking at me. So, sorry. I will... That that was one thing about my last video. Um, I had put... I had made a, a, an introduction and I'd put some pictures of uh, the cat and the dogs and somehow they seemed to disappear. Um, I don't quite know what happened. My editing, I suppose. Um... So, um, I will try this time, you just saw a fly go past then, um, I will try and put some pictures of the animals um, so that you can see who keeps me company during the day. Because um, they do, um, I have no one else to talk to apart from you now. Um, I talk to the dogs, I talk to the cat, they talk back <laughs> in their own way. Um, although I'm a, the clumper spaniel, if any of you have got a clumper spaniel, if I said, um, whoa, woes, you will know what I mean. A clumber spaniel goes whoa, woes. Um, I'm not going to do it on camera, but I will try and get a video of her going whoa, whoa. It is amazing. It is a clumber spaniel thing. It, it's, um... It's not a bark, it's not a howl, um, <coughs> excuse me, but it's, it's, it's a whoa, 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 um, you'll see what I mean, if I can get it before I post this, I'll, I'll add it to the video, so that you can see what Bracken, that's a name, the Clump of Spaniel, what Bracken does, it is so funny, um, so there you go, right, enough about me and my life which not very interesting um right what have i been doing during last week since i saw you well um i've been doing i've been doing my stitching um i think i've done i think i've done quite a bit um i never showed you a picture of um the heaven and earth design that I'm doing, um, but Deer Creek by Donna Gelsinger. I forgot to show you a picture of it last week. Anyway, uh, if I can, can you see that? Yeah. Um, that's the, I've sort of, I'm down here. Um, so I'm about here. Got that one to do next. Finish these two pages off. Um, and I must be halfway. Um, which I started it June of last year. So if I can carry on the rate I'm going, I should make, make it in about another year's time. Um, so that's that. Um, I'm doing it on 
I forgot to tell you last week. It's on um, 25 count Lugana, um, one over one, and um, without taking it out of its uh, uh, the Q snap. That's where I've got to. I will put a picture if I'm capable of doing it. Oh, and to show you where it was too. But we've I've done quite a bit of here. Bit of the brown, so I've probably done that much. So that's not too bad. It's it's stitching up quite nicely. Um I, I do I do park um, and I did used to, I used to stitch straight across one way, then back, then one way, then back. And then I think I did that for about 20 pages. And then I got a bit, I don't know, I got a bit bored. And so I sort of, I park, but I do a bit of cross country. Um, you know, I'll finish what's on my on my thread um, I also do waist knots as you can see I think you have a bit closer look um, just so that I don't have to um, I don't have to keep turning back the I'm not going to show you the back well you can't really see it very well um, so that you don't have to keep turning the project over you can just start there start your stitching and what's at the back will then as you you stitch down over it will cover it and then you just snip these bits off when when you get to them and then they're gone um so that was a needle where did that go so yeah yeah i'm enjoying this one and um, it looks good so next time I'll, I'll take it out the Q snap so that you can see um, but if anyone's got any questions just ask um, right the other thing um, I was saying I was doing was the merrily merrily we welcome spring I you can see that without any glare and I shall put a picture um, up to show you where I had got to um, but I'm now um, I haven't done any more of the alphabet I'll start at the top I haven't done any more of that but what I have done was I've gone um, I've gone all the way down this side um, I've still got some buds to finish oh, here um, but I've got down to going across at the bottom um, so I've got a little bit that side and we started going across there um, I love the bird. The bird is so nice. Do you want to close up with that? Can you see? I hope you can see because I can't see. Um, it's really interesting. It, it was nice to use a different colour as well. Uh, that, that was nice. Um, but my biggest worry is uh, whether, <laughs> whether they're going to be tough at the bottom. <laughs> um, yeah. Um, I know it goes up and down, up and down. So I'm, well, if it doesn't, I'll just fudge it. Or she'll have to. Um, it'll be right. It'll be all right. We'll, we'll sort it. We'll get it there. So, and this one, this is, um, these are uh, the... The 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 deer crit I forgot to say is DMC um to one over one. This is um forty count oakum 
by Picture This Plus and it's I'm doing this um one over two um which I think I forgot to tell you last week sorry um so and the threads for this one uh there's uh Weeks Dye Works um there's a couple there's a couple of classic classic colour works and I think there's two gentle arts. Um, some of them are variegated, so they go from light to dark, which which is nice. But the the only thing I've noticed about stitching this is the threads have cottoned up on me um, at the back, uh, which DMC don't seem to. Seem to get more knots with this one. Um, I don't know if if anyone's noticed that or whether it's just me uh whether i got too long a piece of thread i don't know maybe i ought to short my thread a bit um but it does seem to it does seem to um not up at the back so let me see we're getting there we're getting there enjoying this one i love doing this one yeah, love this one. Um, the the mirabilia that I showed you last week, I haven't done anything, so there's no point showing you really. Um, I'll get I'll get it out next week if anyone wants to see it. Um, I might try and do a bit on it. Um, but that's that's those two. Um, now what I did forget last week to show you was when I bought the Blackbird Design Merrily Merrily, um, I'd also bought um, another pattern, uh, Rosewood Manor, uh, which I'd really quite like to try. And that's the Autumn Quakes, if we can, that doesn't glare, by Rosewood Manor. Now that looks really nice. I'd like to try that sometime. Um, now the only thing was, um, as I was looking through the pamphlet, um, the thread for it, the thross, fluff, the floss, sorry, put my teeth back in. The floss is uh, Valandi, three strand Valandi. Um, it's hand over dyed. I've never heard of this. Um, as far as I can see, it's a bit wool like. Now, has anyone used it? If you have, please comment below and let me know what it's like. Um, they're, they're saying to do it on 28 count, um, uh, a picture this plus shell. Um, and they're saying you've got to use, it's three strand floss and you use it just as it is. Um, apart from the, uh, an Algerian eyelet is just one, one strand. Um, but I wasn't, I was thinking about converting the colours, to be honest, either to DMC or the Weeks Colour Works. Um, so, um, I don't know. So if you know what it's like, let me know. Um, so I've got that. And also I've been looking in, my, occasionally if I happen to get out, um, I'll get a cross stitch magazine. I've only got four <laughs> minutes. So you can see I don't go out very often. But there's a pattern in here that I'd quite like to do sometime. Um, just trying to see when this is. It's um, it's the Autumn Gold, uh, classic cross-stitch gold. And it's the this one that I quite like with the squirrel. Um, and do it there. I quite like that. 
I thought that was quite nice to do. That'd be really nice. I was watching the other day, Saturday morning, um, Sean was on the phone, um, he'd gone in the bedroom, um, we live in a bungalow, um, so that I don't have to do stairs, and um, I was looking out the window, and there was this squirrel, we get a lot of squirrels, but there's been a couple of squirrels just out the front here, and um, he was bounding along with this nut in his mouth, I don't know what it was, um, but he, he, at the back of our bedroom, there's, there's grass, and he bounded along, he dug his hole out, he pushed his nut through, and it was the way, with his paws, he was patting it down, and then he pushed it like this, it was so funny, he must have buried two or three nuts like that, until he sort of saw me, and then, then he went, but I thought that was so funny watching him. I mean, there's so much wildlife out here. It's lovely. But, yeah, I'd really like to do that. Um, it's it's suggested on 14 count Ada. Uh, no, it's not. It's on 28 count they're recommending, I think. Yeah, 28 count. So that, that's one that I might, might do in time. So... Um, what else is there that I can tell you? Um, um, I don't know. Um, I think this is probably longer than last week's. I hope so. Um, as I get used to talking to you, I um, might be able to do a bit more and find a bit more to talk about. Um, so it's looked like it's going to rain now. Oh, heck. Oh, dear. Hubby won't be a bad pee. Um, so, anyway, um, if you've got any questions you want to ask me, um, I'd be grateful. Any comments, I just love hearing from you. It, it's really nice to get any comment um, coming. Yeah. Really enjoyed it. So, um, thank you. For watching um deadly silence there <laughs> sorry ah oh, brain freeze um yeah thank you for watching and thank thank you for everybody that has subscribed and has come back thank you um uh, yeah you don't know how much it means to me it's you sit here and you talk to nobody but a dot on an ipad and you, you it's unbelievable that it's getting out to everybody um but yeah so anyway i'm gonna finish um thank you for everybody's comments and likes and everyone that subscribed um if you knew and this is the first time you've seen the video please like please subscribe um and i'll see you next week Oh, just as I turned it off, she did it. <laughs> 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 so openly about depression can encourage others to come forward and also share their problems, which I love ones too. This morning she posted an update. <laughs> 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 Ready. And it's on his way.